Okay, how's it going guys? Connorist here and welcome to a brand new playthrough. Today we're going to be playing Pokemon Blossom of the Soul. So this is a fan game and it is a completed fan game, I believe. I remember playing this uh, months ago. I think I did just like a short fan game showcase of it months ago. Uh, that was when it was just a demo. Now it's, uh, it's a full completed game and we're going to go ahead and play through it you know the full thing this time so uh yeah if you want to play it yourself link will be in the description down below with that being said let's hop right into it let's do this thing dude uh fast off and let's go frlg everything else can stay the same new game welcome new trainer this is a pre-recorded message Sent to all rookie trainers in your region. Nice. I'm the guide, and I'm ready to help you with anything you need. You may skip my speech and head right to the important stuff if you wish. Uh, sure. You a boy or a girl? I'm not totally sure. Yes. Please enter your name. You put Mark, is that the name you want? Yes. Your name was registered as Mark. You're back. You must have filled out your form successfully. Oh, if only I could see your eager face, the face of a Greenhorn trainer. Here on Greenhorn Island, we are the very best at starting trainers out on their grand journeys. You'll be an amazing trainer someday, I can assure you. That concludes the tutorial. This was the guide. Signing off. Goodbye, Mr. Guide. Don't know if we'll ever see that guy again. About 10 years ago. I knew you'd be here. The walk was worth it in the end. What are you doing here, Blade? I should be asking you that. Myrtle? Myrtle? I'm gonna say Myrtle, because that just sounds better. Or mitle. Mitle? I don't know. You should be long gone by now. I should. But I don't really want to go back there. Not back to the Karakara region. The Karakara region. I want to go back there so bad. Or I want to go back there badly. You of all people want to return? I do. I haven't stepped foot in that place since I was a young girl. I have unfinished business there. Distant as always. Blade, just leave it. It's all water under the bridge. You're wrong. It's still important to me all these years later. If you want closure, it might not be what you want. I'm willing to take that risk. I understand. My boat's here now. I'll see you soon, Blade. It might not be soon, but I won't forget you. Okay. Mark, honey, time to get out of bed. Heck, it's already nighttime. How long can you sleep? Do I have to, Mom? Do I have? Of course, it's finally time for you to do something productive today. So wake up and come downstairs right away. I don't want to. Don't make me. No. Let's grab our potion. Let's grab our potted plant. No? Okay. You look so tired. I need you to take this package to Rose for me, okay? Huh? Who's Rose? Silly Mark. I mean, Professor Rose, who lives literally next door. <laughs> How would I know that, Mom? I never go outside. You put the package away. And here's your monthly allowance. Ah, oh, sick to 5K. Ah, oh, thanks, Mom. Appreciate it. The weather's as beautiful as can be. It's a great day outdoors. In other news, severe thunderstorms have ravaged the island. Residents are urged to stay indoors. Ah, oh, damn. Because of the harsh flooding, the one-mile bridge near Lumia Town has been closed. It is certainly not a time to be delivering anything to anyone. This is your anchor, Wally Pyrite, saying that's the way it is. 
Uh, never mind that. I think it's about time to modernize. You need a TV instead of a radio. There's a TV in your room and a computer. Huh, yeah, the PC runs an old OS and the TV's plug is broken. So I can't even turn it on. <laughs> Ungrateful. Just for that, I'm taking your allowance. No, mom, please. Aw, oh, dude, I just had that. Mom, no, <laughs> but mom. No, but mom, nothing. Please deliver that package, please. And don't get in any trouble with your friend. My friend has a name, mom, it's... Dude, I don't know my friend's name. Why do I gotta name my friend, dude? Uh... Yes, I'll go... Let's go Mariah, how about that? That works. Just Mariah? Sure. It's Mariah. Huh? What's that? Is that the sound of you going already? <laughs> Uh, check available quests by going into the quest section in the pause menu. It'll give you an idea of where to go if you're feeling lost. Actually, before you start, would you like to play on skilled mode? <laughs> Do I look like a skilled person? All Pokemon you encounter, whether they be wild or owned, will be scaled. Scaling is based on your current team. You can make the game easier, more difficult, it's all up to you. Uh... I'm not a very skilled person, so I mean, if you want, it to, if it's too easy, we'll turn it on later. But for now, we can just uh, keep it off. Oh yeah, <laughs> great weather, huh? Someone's coming. Oh, look who it is. Hey, Mark. Yo, yo. Ah, it's Mariah. What now? Remember a really, really long time ago? Uh, sure. Well. The one time we said one day, it'll be today. Today? What's today? Today's the perfect day to finally muster up the courage to go into the town graveyard. Uh, no, I've got an important errand, I'll pass. We're best friends, troublemakers for life. We make our parents go crazy every day. It's been so long that we did something wild. <laughs> My mom already took my allowance. She'd kill me if she knew I fooled around in the graveyard. My dad would too. We'd die together. And we'd end up at the graveyard anyway. Let's go. All right, I guess we're gonna go die today. Let's go. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Oh, look at this. It's a graveyard already. Okay, I'm brave. Mark going first. What, why? You're in front of me. And besides, I haven't told you why we're here. It's obvious we're gonna steal the old treasure that's said to lie here. The old flower or whatever? Thing is to never be touched, ever again. But why exactly though? I'm the only person brave enough to care. So enough of this talking. I suspect that the grave that hides our treasure is the topmost grave. The topmost grave. This one looks pretty normal to me. Nothing special. Okay, then the rightmost grave. Onward. Uh, this one again looks normal to me. Uh, you sure this flower is even here anymore? I'm sure. Maybe the bottom leftmost grave. This time we'll definitely get it. Okay, bottom left. Nope, nothing suspicious here. I'm gonna go finish my errand, Mariah. This is a waste of time. How could you say that, Mark? You've never chickened out before. You're getting soft. I'm not getting soft, I'm getting annoyed. Face it, there's nothing here anymore. One more gravestone, please, for me. No, search on your own. Fine, I'll search this one. I'm gonna dig in front of it like so. Oh, there's something here. It's... Just a piece of old junk. Ah, sorry Mark for wasting your time. Now, how about we go finish up whatever errand you had to do? Remember where Rose's lab was? Just next to your house. Yes, apparently everybody knows where the professor lives except for me. What's up? I said the graveyard. My house. Wait, what? I said the graveyard. My house. What? Okay. Mark, 
You know, this is that weird old guy's house. They said he boils all his unwanted visitors alive, then eats them. Good God. That's just a myth. I don't care. I believe it. So I'm not going in there. Okay. Don't want to get boiled alive. That would uh, suck. Guess we're going to the lab. Hello. Huh? What brings you here today, Mark? Mariah? Mark here had something for you. Oh, that mother of yours. She made you go out in the rain? The package is soaked. Rose, is that the package you said you were waiting for all the for all week? This is it. I'll contact my friend to see how I can put them together. It's in the box, Rose. Nosy kid. I'm not telling you now. Not so mean of you. Come on, Mark, let's head to your home. My home? And who said you could invite yourself there? Don't be like that. Come on, we're out of here. Okay. It's been a while since I've been in your room. Mark, comfy. Yeah, there's literally one chair. <laughs> yeah, real comfy, all right. Yeah, at least this PC works. Only item storage, though. Right, right. Hey, wasn't our grave trip, graveyard trip so awesome, though? No, I was soaking wet out there. I probably gained the damp ability. Well, we're gonna do something else tomorrow. We're gonna go to the pier and watch the sunset together. Huh, that actually doesn't sound half bad. Uh, the sunsets there are beautiful. So tomorrow afternoon, meet me at the pier. You know where the pier is, right? No. Just keep walking east, then go south near the Pokemart. East, okay. Got it. If you get lost, the quest log will direct you. Cool. Next afternoon. Okay, it's time. I slept through most of the day again. I think Mom said she'd be shopping today, so I won't have to make any excuses. All right. East and then south. All right. Uh... What do you mean? They said east! Wait a minute! <laughs> Hold on! Is there any other path over here? Or do they mean west? There's no other path, so I'm assuming they meant west, but they said east. Somebody doesn't know their directions, either me or the game. <laughs> Surely that's east. This is east. This is west. Surely. Hi. Mock pizza? Ooh, can I have one? I would like a pizza, please. No? Okay. Guess we're not getting a pizza, but we'll get some orange berries. Something, at least. Have you heard of Blipbug? I heard it's smart. Oh, yeah, that's great. It's just what I want, a smart bug. Yeesh. Did you see that thunderstorm mark? I was going to be blown away for sure. There's nothing there. Got a couple boats. We got no money, so there's no point to go to the mart. Ah, here we are. Oh, I see Mariah now. And a random fisherman just chilling, you know, doing fisherman things. Oh, you're here. So, we're just gonna uh, relax, huh? Maybe watch the sunset? No. <laughs> no, that's not why we're here. I wanted to give you this. Huh? What's this? Flower. What? Is this the flower we were looking for at the graveyard? Sure is. Last night during the storm, I went out and dug. The only glimmer of hope in that desolate little graveyard. Why are you giving this flower to me? Well, it's a symbol of our friendship. Homies for life. The Gracidia. Flowers sometimes bundled in bouquets to convey gratitude on special occasions like birthdays. Cool. Ah, oh, it's sweet of you. It's a thing I never thought I'd say. And so, in celebration, 
Tonight, we're gonna get our own Pokemon from Professor Rose. You're kidding. No. So onward, Mark. Let's march off to the Pokemon Lab. Huh? But uh, what about the rest of the sunset? Mark, the sun sets every day. Now come on. Okay. To the lab it is, dude. Screw the sunset. I'd rather have a Pokemon, dude. To question your excellence, but it's not the lab. Okay. It's a just, there's a gym in town, dude. Hold on. Can I take it on? Hello. I want a Pokemon. Hand it over. Uh, oh. Today, too? Hey, we're here for some important business. We want our own Pokemon from you, woman. <laughs> Yeah, that's the way to ask for it. <laughs> You're kidding. I couldn't even trust you with my shopping list. If I may add something, uh, I've known Mariah for a long time, and not only could I depend on things going right with her around, hey, but at least you can depend on her to get things that... to get that errand done, no matter how bad things may go. Not sure if that was a compliment, but I'll take it. See, Rose? Even Mark can depend on me. Huh. Uh, I'm not convinced. Rose, don't do us. Don't, uh, Rose really doesn't like us. Tell you what. I'll give you two a Pokemon. Because I want... I want to test you two. And what's the best way to test out the will of a person? Give them a Pokemon. Uh, oh, it's Myrtle. Myrtle? Myrtle? I'm gonna say Myrtle. Myrtle, sweetie. Can you please do the honors? Oh, yes, ma'am. Why is her name still a question mark when we literally know her name is Myrtle at this point? Oh, I haven't introduced myself. I'm Myrtle. I help Professor Rose with her studies. There we go. Rose researches the environment and the entirety of the region. We've been busy because nature is certainly diverse here on these islands. Yeah, and I've noticed interesting patterns going on recently, so I've been hard at work. Uh, I need a break. Maybe I should tag along with these two here as well. Then go. I'm all for it. I wouldn't want you sitting here like a log. I know how you like to eat, especially key lime pies, our region's specialty. So I wouldn't want you gaining weight. Damn. Hey. Ha. Huh. That's funny to think that little cute girl can eat that much. Uh, I mean, if, <laughs> if you have any extra pies, I could take them off your hands. Huh. Uh, this Merle girl's weird. Something tells me I need to protect my food. Anyway, just pick your Pokemon before I get hungry. So, uh, which Pokemon do you want? Ooh. Ooh, they're Gen 8. Grookey, Sobble, or Scorbunny? Huh. I don't know much about Gen 8, so let me pause real quick and kind of decide which one I want. So I'll see in a bit. Okay, we're back. And after a hard decision, I decided that we're going to go with Scorbunny. So yes, I want the fire type score bunny. Thank you very much. Uh wow, well, I didn't really haven't really thought of a, a name. Yeah, even though it's a female, I guess we'll go with Jack, because you know Jack Rabbit. Get it? No, okay. Okay then, I'm picking this one. She's gonna go for Sobble. That's a great choice. Okay, uh what else do I give him? Give him this bag of goods, too. I, I like me a bag of goods, dude. I'd love a bag of goods. You check your bag of goods that Myrtle gave you. Inside there was a Pokedex. Nice. And there's more things in here. Five Pokeballs. Nice. And a Pokemon box link. Device that allows you to access the Pokemon storage system. Ah, oh, sick. There are some places where it won't work. Sick, dude. Nice. Please note your Pokemon will not be healed up if placed into a box. It may not work in some special areas as well. And 5k! Hey, dude. I'll take a free 5k. Not bad. But, uh, why do we need so much money for? Don't question the money. When do you ever question money? The real world is pretty expensive. Also, it's 
uh, also a bit of an important tip that'll be a huge help. You can skip text by using the escape key. It makes things go by much quicker. Ah, but uh, don't skip anything important. Ah, cool! Before you guys head out, though, uh, please meet me at the Mock Pizza building near the pier. If you get lost, the quest list can point you in the right direction. This isn't a race, but I'm getting there first. Oh boy. Oh, they left us behind. I'm not from this town. I'm actually from Mondela's city on the mainland. If you could take me to where Rose asked, uh, that'd be great. Sure, I've lived here all my life. I could draw the town from memory. On my lead, Myrtle. Or Myrtle. Still don't know how to pronounce it, but oh well. In the beginning, quest completed. Pizza party. Oh, great. It's just the quest I wanted to start. All right. Let's take a look at our score bunny. It's already holding an Orenberry. That's pretty sick. It's often lost in thought. Nice. Um. Okay. All right. I don't know what mild nature does. But okay. Has blaze. Uh, and tackle growl. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, let's head out. Uh, do you want to see the guy who apparently eats his visitors? <laughs> Eek! Mark, I'm not going in that house! Ah, sorry for scaring you, Myrtle. I'm gonna call her Myrtle, even though I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. I suppose you know the myth around this house. Yeah, the old man has a pet lion, tiger, and bear. <laughs> and they come and maul you, if, maul you to death. I don't know what those things are, but I won't go in the house just for you. Thank you, Mark. I can live to eat another day. Fantastic. Uh, I have no idea. You want to go to the graveyard? No? Okay. Uh, do you want to go to my place? You know, I have a chair. And I have a TV that doesn't turn on. No? Okay. All right, well, here's the pizza place. I guess we'll just uh, go here. Mark and Myrtle are here. So this is Mock Pizza. Yes, yes. Awesome. I'm a champ over there, dude. Look at him. And all his champy glory. So, Professor, why are we here? To get a fresh pizza, that's what. What? This isn't some super important meeting? Oh, sure. It's important to eat. Gotta keep your strength up. Oh, true, dude. True. Welcome to Mock Pizza. Uh, what would you like to order? Uh, what's on the menu? Pizza. <laughs> Man, I'm hungry. Let's see. Maybe I'll get two number... Oh, God. Two number nines. Seven orders of key lime pies. Two orders of the 45-count jelly-filled donuts. What the heck? And a large soda pop. It's a lot of food. Yes, ma'am. We'll have that one as soon as possible. Jesus. You certainly won't eat all of that, right? Yes, I can. I did win the Camry Region Eating Contest four years in a row. Amai was impressed with me. Her spicy curry did hit the spot. Hmm. And as a matter of fact, my friend Benny... Quiet, Mural. Or Myrtle. I'm eavesdropping. What are they talking about? Did you hear the rumors spreading about some person named Blade? No, what's up? I hear they're causing trouble for towns and cities around the region. The police even sent out a bounty today. The bounty is a hundred thousand for whoever brings that criminal to justice. Hundred thousand? I'll send out every dog Pokemon I have to sniff them out. I didn't get to read that last part. Your order's all ready, so uh, the bill comes out to... Ah, oh, I didn't hear the last part. Yeah, neither did I, dude. I said the bill comes out to... Uh, I've heard enough of it. Ha. Huh. Who goes by the name of Blade? Trying to act all cool or what? I don't know. The name Blade sounds, uh, really scary. Whoa! The bill's a hundred thousand! Oh, it's crazy! Why so much? I'm gonna have to catch that Blade so the bounty could be all mine. No, the bounty's mine. I want my dad and I to move to Belfer City in the Camry region and live comfortably. Now I want that bounty so I can get a new TV for my room. <laughs> One that turns on. Not if I get it first and order all the food I want for mock pizza. 
All right, all right, how about this? I go outside and think about it. Yo, who's paying for this food? Hold on now. Just kidding. I'm leaving you all with the bill. <laughs> Good luck on your journey. Ah, dude. Wait a minute, she left without paying. Run. Run. Isn't it illegal to dine and dash? Uh, it's fine. I've got the bill all handled. What? You're rich after all, Myrtle? Oh, that does sound... That name does sound rich after all. Uh, no, I'm not rich. I just know how to save my money. Keep the change, good sir. Come again any time to mock pizza. And before you go, add mock pizza to, pizza to your Poke Gear contact list like so. Aw, oh, can I get a delivery? Yo, I can get pizza delivered in Pokemon, dude. My dreams have come true. <laughs> God, technology is so advanced, dude. I can get pizza delivered in a Pokemon, dude. That's amazing. Oh, man. Fan games have come so far. <laughs> That way you can call and we'll deliver pizza anywhere in the region directly to you. Ah, cool. I'll be using that a lot. Let's all go outside now. I'm done with talking. Did we even order anything, dude? I think Myrtle's the only one that actually ordered anything. <laughs> Sorry that the Rose left us there. Uh, she doesn't like paying for bills. Well, uh, thanks for buying us the food. Even though you kind of left it all there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, how about this? Mark and I battle right now. A friendly rivalry, rival battle. Oh, that'd be interesting to watch. You can't challenge me out of the blue like this. When you're a trainer, you better be ready to rumble at any given moment. Ready or not, here I come. Okay. Let's do this shit, dude. Please don't have a water gun. I can take a pound. Pound is no problem. Thank you, Orenberry. Doesn't look like that Sobble came with an Orenberry, so, uh... That sucks. <laughs> sucks for Sobble, dude. Hey, I learned Ember. Sick. My first battle then into a crushing loss? <laughs> no way. So Mark won. Uh, great work there. Uh, now that's all done, you should all go to Route 1. Hey, what about the gym? Don't you want to catch more Pokemon first? Nah, my starter and I are fine alone. Uh, depends on the type of gym. I suggest catching more Pokemon with those Pokeballs that Rose gave you. Oh, before I go, take this. Town map. Sick, dude. Just so you won't get lost in Kara Kara. Feel free to check out that town map anytime. I'll see you in the next town once you've got your first gym badge, Mark. Alright. Uh, I want to check out the... Huh? What? Looks like my Pokemon would rather walk alongside me. Bet it'll make them happier if I let them walk with me. Okay. Guy looks bigger than me, dude. Why does this score buddy look bigger than me? Hold on. This thing's like six foot tall. It's a big score bunny, dude. All right. I want to check out the typing of the gym. What? Ah, the gym leader totally destroyed my poor Pokemon. He should have listened to Myrtle. I'm heading to the Pokemon Center, like, right away. I'm not fighting him now, I just want to know the typing. So I can know what to look for, what to prepare for. Ah, new challenger! I am simply called the Gym Guy. Pleased to meet you! Oh, is that a Pokedex I see on you? Huh. Looks like Professor Rose has her eye on you. That does it! Starting today, you're champ to be, Mark! Huh, uh, if you want to be the top trainer in Kara Kara, that is, uh, I'm not interested in battles. Of course, I'm here to defeat all the trainers and win. Oh, that's the spirit, your champion material. I'll give you a starting boost. Take this little gift of mine. Is it fresh water? No, it's soda pop. Sick. Recently, the fresh water being sold in Kara Kara seems to be a little less healthy. So I switched to soda pop. Anyway, tell me this. How many Pokemon have you caught? Huh, let me see. You caught one Pokemon, right? Sorry, looks like you can't quite fight the gym leader yet. All you need is to catch three Pokemon. I'm doing this because Rumi beat the last challenger so bad. It was pretty funny. <laughs> Not in the mean way, but in the wow, that was brutal way. Come back so you can challenge the Lumia Town Gym. 
I just want to know the type, man. Just tell me the type. That doesn't tell me a type. God damn it, dude. Why can't I just know the typing first? Ah, lame. All right. Oh yeah, hold that. This up. Oh, it's a Pokeball dispenser, and it's out of order. Well, that sucks. I'm gonna crush the competition. Me and Weedle. Yes, because Weedles are known to crush the competition. Maybe I should buy a couple of these since we have to catch three. I don't know if I'm gonna use three right now, but I'll have to catch at least two more so we can actually take on the gym. So let's go do that then. Route one. Wonder what it'll have. Please be something more than just Rattatas and Pidgeys. Please. Please no Rattata or Pidgey. All right, route one, here we go. First up is this item. It's a Pokeball, I'll take it. Save in case something bad happens. Oh my god! Yo, are those. Are those Ella Kid? Oh, hold on, dude. Freaking Ella Kid. Look at this. Look at this, dude. Yeah, I'll take Ella Kid. I do not mind Ella Kid in the slightest. Ella Kid, don't kill me, please. Ella Kid, be a good boy. And don't murder me. Okay, that's as low as we're gonna get it. Let me heal real quick before it murders me. Here we go. Here we go. Pokeball, go! Gotta like, flip, flip the cap around just like Ash. What? I didn't flip my cap, dude, hold on. I didn't turn my hat around, hold on, dude, jeez. Dude. Dude. Just stay in the ball. I've already wasted two. Dude. <laughs> I've wasted now three balls. Three Pokeballs. And this Ella kid is not wanting to stay inside. Dude, that's four. I've wasted four balls. Four balls! Five balls! I've wasted five balls! He's as low as it can go, dude! It can't get any lower than that! Six! It's not even shaking! Oh my god. I, I saved right before I went to the grass. I'm not losing those six balls because this Ella kid wants to be stingy. I am not losing those six Pokeballs, dude. I refuse to do that. Uh, where are all the Pokemon go? Oh, there's something. Ew. What the heck is that? Okay, uh, I don't want any of that. I don't want any of that. Ooh, do I want rock gruff? Uh, I'm gonna say no. It's another one of those stupid sheep. I don't, I don't think I want rock gruff. It's interesting, but I don't want it. More mighty yenna. Or... Ooh, is that rookity? Ooh, I want you. Corviknight, dude. Corviknight is so badass. I love Corviknight, dude. Corviknight, unnerve. Uh, sure. Corviknight is so freaking cool, dude. It looks so awesome. I will love to have you join the squad. Squad up, Rookity. Squad up. Tiny bird. Jumping nimbly about, the small-bodied Pokemon takes advantage of even the slightest opportunities. 
disorient larger po knight, uh, Pokemon, yeah. Uh, Core of a Knight, Knight, Lance. Because, you know, Lance a lot. I think that's a Knight. There we go. Alright, cool. We got one. I'm gonna go heal now. Can I heal at home? Can I visit the guy who'll uh, boil me? No? Okay. Cool. We have Rookity. That's something, dude. That's actually something. It uh, evolves into Steel Flying, so that's nice. So you're not going to heal me, mother. I see how it is. Can I heal in my bed? Yo, how do I heal? Oh, there's a Pokemon Center. Duh. I was going to say, how the heck do I heal? There's a Pokemon Center literally in town. Okay. Uh, I'm going to pause here. Uh, I'm going to go heal, and then I'm going to go catch a third Pokemon. Uh, if I don't catch anything that I want to use, I'll just probably catch something just to fill the slot. And then we'll probably battle some trainers on Route 1, and then we'll go take on the gym. So uh, let me cut here while I go heal and catch a third Pokemon. See you in a bit. Okay, we're back. And as you can see there, I finally ended up catching an Elekid, dude. Oh my god. So I caught it. Named Duracell, because, uh, you know, battery, electricity, yeah. Has static, which is pretty nice. Uh, no Thundershock, Quick Attack, and a Leer. So, uh, yep, that's great. Let's go ahead and put him there. Uh, before we take on the gym, we're going to go ahead and fight a couple trainers, just so we can get some levels. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? Let me show you how battles go. Okay, show me. Show me, Mr. Joe. Show me how experienced you are. You and your level 3 woo-woo. Yep. So experienced. I can see the experience coming from you. So amazing. All this experience you have. Um, okay. How do I do this? <laughs> okay. God, all these experienced trainers, dude. Look at them. They're everywhere. Oh, you have a Rookity! Not bad. I have one of those, too. Young Goose. That should be fine. Two shot at worst. Oh, I got the Paralysis. I don't like that you touched me. I don't like being touched. Oh, is this what a loss feels like? God, these trainers, dude. Found a free potion. I'll take it. Anybody else want to fight me? Hey, we, that was it. Two trainers? Two trainers? Okay, dude. Okay, dude. I was expecting more. Guess not. All right. Uh, let's go take on the gym. Let's see if we're... If not, we don't have, we're not high enough leveled. We're going to have to... Uh, Gonna have to do a little bit of leveling up in the wild, which I do not like, but you know, we'll have to do what we have to do. We'll go try it though. We'll definitely try it. I'm gonna save real quick just in case we're not ready for it. You ready, Duracell? Oh, you're holding something. Hey, you've got a rappel on you, dude. Sick. I'm here. Ah, it's champ to be Mark. So, let me see. Did you catch three Pokemon yet? Hmm, let me see. You caught three Pokemon, right? Alright, you passed the requirement. Uh, should I tell you a bit about the gym leader, or will you head in first like a wild Bouffalant? Nah, dude, tell me. Alright. The gym leader Rumi uses, okay, normal type Pokemon. Chop up her team using fighting type moves to your advantage. She can't hit rock poke types very well either. To get through this gym, you'll need to read the script on the wall. So with that in mind, go get him, champ to be, Mark. All right. Oh, uh, I didn't see any fighting types in the wild. I mean, I did see a wild rock rough or rock, but uh. uh here's the first question. Are normal type Pokemon weak to fighting types? Left, yes. Right, no. Of course not, dude. Why would they be? That's a dumb question. <laughs> oh, what? I'm wrong? No way. I want the experience. Of course I'm going to choose the wrong way. Do I need the experience? Hello? Level 5 Wooloo. Yeah, I probably need the experience, dude. Yo, that did nothing. I was expecting more damage. At least half. Alright, 
But a bunch of normal types shouldn't be too bad. Low, oh, you know low kick, dude. Oh, we're, we're good. Yo, low kick him. Kick him so low. Come on. Here we go, dude. Yes, perfect. Duracell's gonna run this gym. Can I go the other way, too? Oh, they both lead, okay. So I only get to fight the trainer if I get it wrong. Cool. Dude, Duracell's gonna run this gym. Hold on. I was not expecting your boy to learn low kick. It's great. All right, I'm ready. Is the normal type the best ever? <laughs> no. Apparently that's the wrong answer. You didn't get the answer. You didn't get the wrong answer, so congrats. But Rumi said to battle anyway. Wow, so she doesn't even think. I don't know if Ruby's a guy or a girl, but even the gym leader doesn't think that's the right answer. <laughs> Damn. Way to disrespect your own... That did nothing. Way to disrespect your own gym type, dude. <laughs> to be fair, it's not, though. Young Goose. This is fine. Eek! Not so hard on me. Eek. Eek indeed. I just saw this game has a freaking timer down there. It has its own uh, own time thing. It's apparently it's Sunday at 9.28 a.m. So that's pretty cool. Here's the final question. Is Roomby the best gym leader of all time? No. Oh. That was the right answer. Congratulations. Even a trick question couldn't phase you. I want the wrong answer, though, dude. Hold on. No. No, give me the challenge. No, fight me. Nah, dude. Aw, oh, man. I wanted to fight, though. Dang it. Oh, well. You holding anything before we go? No? Oh, I, I, have, I think I have orange berries. Hold on. Let me give you a couple orange berries. Yeah, I do. Here, you can have one. I don't think I'm going to give one to Rookie D or Lance. I don't think he'll need one. Hiya. Name's Rumi, as you might know already. I run the Lumia Town Gym. I'm besties with everyone here. My take on battles is just to have loads of fun. Wouldn't you agree? Ah, it doesn't matter. I'm too hyped up. Let's battle already for your purity badge. Can I speed up? I haven't even tried and checked. Oh, I can. Ah, oh, cool. Okay, yeah, dude, if I can speed up in during battles, I will. That'll just help a lot. Dude, you potioned. I got a paralysis. Haha. -ha. You're still hitting me, though. And now you're out. Got the crit. Duracell. Zigzagoon. Oh! Yo, is that a lowland? Or not a lowland Zigzagoon, but a, a regional Zigzagoon? Yo, hold on. Zig. Zagoon. Yo, that thing looks wild. Oh, it's a, yeah, it's a Galarian Zigzagoon. It's dark normal. Galarian Zigzagoon. Crazy. And it's destroyed because it's four times weak to fighting. And Smurgle. So much fun, but I'm not stopping here. Yeah, neither am I. Neither am I! Get destroyed! Oh my god, Duracell! Whoa! You're just a rookie, but you're so strong! I'm a god! What did you expect? Oh, my Smurgle really put up a fight, huh? No, it didn't! It got one-shotted! I'm proud of all my Pokemon. I'm proud to hand you your first gym badge. The Purity Badge. <laughs> Oh my god! Huh, if you want to be stronger, take this TM. Is it return? Yeah, it's return. Which won't be, wouldn't be too bad, actually. Return is a popular move. I don't really use it during battles, so it's better off with you. 
Right about now, the One Mile Bridge should be open. Great timing. Mandarin Town is just across the bridge. I know the gym leader there, too. Though she's tough, I'll say. But you can handle it. Then we're gonna just have fun. Now go along. The pizza party quest is apparently completed. The Mandarin Island Match quest start. Okay. Well, that's that. All right, cool. We'll go ahead and leave, heal up, maybe buy some items, and then head off to uh, One Mile Bridge. Which I'm assuming is, you know, one mile. What? Oh, hi. Mark, tell me, did you defeat Rumi? Actually, I did. See my badge? Mark, Mark, don't baloney sandwich me. That's not the purity badge. Holy shite, no tick, it really is. Our Smurgle really wiped the floor with me. Ah, I probably lost so bad it'd be the top news story on the Kara Kara Chronicle. The Kara Kara Chronicle? Yeah, the region's number one news source on the radio and on TV. Watch it sometime, it might be helpful. Ah, anyway, let me go train somewhere on Route 1 now that I'm done sulking. Uh, where did Meryl go again? Oh, uh, probably across the One Mile Bridge. Meryl's weird. It's like, all I really know about her is that she likes to eat. Ahem. Anyway, aside from that, head there next, Mark. I'll try to catch up to you two. Yeah, sure, dude, whatever. All right. Well, uh, anyways, guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end this ep first episode off here. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. It's been Connor. So I'll uh, see you guys next time with some more Pokemon Blossom of the Soul. Thanks for watching again. And if you want to play the game yourself, link will be in the description down below. With that being said, thanks for watching again, and peace out.